Today, I'm gonna to show you guys how you can dodge arrows without doing anything. All of the arrows these skeletons are shooting at me go straight to one spot. First thing you wanna do is go ahead and say slash give at s command underscore block in chat. Now go ahead and place the command block down and inside of it, we are going to have it on a repeat, unconditional and always active. Now inside the command block, we are going to say execute the word at, then the symbol at e bracket, type equals arrow and bracket now we're gonna have a lot of is ifs so bear with me if block tilde tilde negative one tilde air if block tilde tilde one tilde air if block tilde one tilde tilde air if block tilde negative one tilde tilde air if block tilde 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 one air if block tilde 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 negative one air run execute as the the symbol at p the word at then the symbol at s if entity the symbol at e bracket type equals arrow comma r equals three end bracket facing entity at s eyes run tp the symbol at e bracket type equals arrow end bracket tilde five tilde tilde one and that is the command right there and just a tip, if you exit out of the command block and go back in just like I did right here, and there's this little dash line, uh, this is actually a new glitch. It will make your command block so it doesn't work. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna switch it to needs redstone, then exit out, then go back in and put it to always active. And now you should see no targets match selector. And sometimes it does this constantly, like it just did it again, so you just need to put it to needs redstone, then always active, then back out, and in again, and as you can see, it says no targets matched. And that is a perfectly normal thing, that just means that it will be always testing, um, and it won't always find a selector unless you are constantly being attacked. So now, as you can see, the arrows will go this way. And just a little thing to note, if you get too close, sometimes they can hit you, or if you're moving in the direction, this is rare though, um, and it shouldn't cause much damage. Thank you guys so much for watching. I know this was a harder video to understand. Hopefully, if you guys have any questions, uh, just let me know in the comment section below. But other than that, I hope you have a great day, and I will see you guys all later. Bye!